That's my setup. Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, today, another video. Thought it would be a good opportunity. There's nice weather. Uh, I have the lawn mower people. I mean, what do you call them? The lawn mowing services here. So there's it's nice and noisy. So they, they always love to interrupt and bomb my videos. But I've been waiting quite a while to do this uh, upgrade. Not an upgrade, but a change. A change to my LEDs. I reached out to Custom Dynamics, which I love working with. Thank you so much, Custom Dynamics. Got a lot of uh, a lot of uh, you know comments about the turn signals. Okay, the signal lights, the turn turn signal lights. The the current inserts that I have inside are LEDs by Custom Dynamics. Now they have a lot of different kinds of uh, options. They have white running. They have orange running. They have white full. They have white. A uh, halo, so many options out there. Initially, when I bought the bike, I, I really liked the orange, the orange contrast because this whole bike is pretty much black and gray, and a little bit tint of uh, chrome every once in a while. But there was nothing breaking up that that uh, you know that black and white, black and gray color. And I liked this orange. Uh, as you recall, the original bike come stock with the orange and i like that that little tint of orange to break up that you know that dark color so when i installed i asked for uh what was it oh i, I initially put orange lens with white inside then i changed it to clear whatever you see now it's pretty much the smoke but the running lights i'll show you in a second the running lights are orange i thought i'd give it a try for two reasons one I like to get additional lighting at night and when I have that orange color, it's not as bright and not as, as significant as just having white, uh, white color, I mean, white light uh, thrown on the street on the road in front of me. Yeah, that's actually, that's the main reason. That is pretty much the main reason. So I'm gonna, so I reached out and uh, they were nice enough to send me the inserts in white. Now the question was, should I get the white halo or the full white? And I said, you know what, if I'm going white already, you know, for to get max uh, lighting, might as well get the full light, the full white, all running lights. So I'm going to, you know, quickly exchange it and I'll put one side on each so you can like compare and say, oh, yeah, this side is nicer. This side isn't nicer. Just take a look before and after. Should be a very, very quick, uh, quick thing. Second thing I'm going to be doing today is one of you guys asked, where do I get, where do I get the... Uh, the power, the power for my phone. Uh, so I, I'm not sure everyone, uh, so I'm not sure you guys that are new to the bike know where there's a, a USB uh, plug. Actually, there is an outlet, USB outlet. Let me show you. And hopefully the guy that asked the question will be able to see this because I don't know, I, you know, every once in a while I throw information here and there, tips here and there in videos. I'm not gonna make a whole video about that little USB plug. So that is the bike, okay? Now the plug itself is right behind the triple tree area, right here. Okay, take a look closely. I'm going zooming in. Can you see it? Yeah, because I can't. Oh, there it is. I missed it for a second. So, do you see it right here? That is the USB. It comes stock. It's, there's no need to install it. It's part of the bike. It was built like that and it's right there. It's covered with this plug. And take a look so you get reference where it is again. Right here. Okay. So that's it. Now let's get to the install. Uh, replacing these is easy with a flat screwdriver. There's like a little, little opening somewhere on the bottom. Just search for it. I left it on the bottom last time I did it. Can't really find it right now, but you put a little flat screwdriver in and pop it out. As I've said, this is the light uh, K 
kit that I got. It's the LED turn signals. And the specific one that I got is plug and play, lifetime warranty. Yeah, the, all our items are a lifetime warranty. But look how pretty it is, by the way, regardless. This one is actually the uh, all white running light. And once the signal light is turned on, it's all orange. All the specs and the specific one is, I don't know which part number. What you, will need to what you need to remember is that it's running white, full running white, and orange for signal light. That's all. Now let's install it. Simple as that. Now let's put one of these. Okay, that's just swapped in. When it's uh, not lit, it's got a little bit of an orange tint it because of the LEDs inside. Now let me turn the lights on. Way, way brighter, way brighter. say which one which one is nicer I know which one is more uh, more effective in terms of lighting so that's it let me go swap the other side that's what I'm here to do swap the other side and finish up wrap up this video Very simple, very simple. Let me show you what it looks like from close up. You know what, I think it's gonna be really significant at light at night. What do you guys say, halo or solid white? I think uh, solid white, but it's a matter of taste, I think. Let me hit, hit those hazards. I mean, the signal lights. There you go. Very simple, guys. Hope you enjoyed this one. I'm Sandy. You're watching Holy Shift, guys. Till the next video. Peace out.